Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm gonna to show you something super fast and super easy because I have to leave for the chiropractor in like six minutes. So uh, I prepared something for you. I'm gonna show you how easy it is and then I'm gonna even show you the product so that I can eat it before I leave for my appointment. So I'll get to that in just a second. With every star, we are born again. Open your heart. Spend this time in your head. We're gonna start off by separating out four eggs. You can save the whites for tortillas or protein sparing bread. You can also double the recipe, half the recipe, whatever you wanna do. To this, we're gonna add a pinch of salt, and then we're gonna melt one tablespoon of butter. And once that's melted, we are going to start slowly pouring that into the yolks until it's very well incorporated. I pour pretty slow so I don't accidentally start to cook the yolks. And then you're going to add one half teaspoon of baking powder. Mix really, really well to get rid of all the lumps and then pour into waffle makers. You can use these little guys or you can use the bigger one as well. This recipe should yield about four I got three and a spit. Alrighty, so here are the egg yolk waffles. They're so easy, so simple, because how many times do you have leftover yolks? If you're separating out eggs, if you haven't bought the cartons, if you're doing the tortillas, if you're doing the protein sparing bread, I used to always buy the, the cartoned eggs because I didn't want to waste the yolks and have a ton of yolks left over. And honestly, we have so many eggs now that I can't justify buying the curtained eggs. <laughs> so these are amazing. I had no idea that they were even a thing. I think Dr. Rimke just recently put up a video about this. All my friends have been doing this forever. I think uh, Carnivore Yogi, y'all, I'm just getting on the bandwagon. Please forgive me for this. I'm going to scarf these down though. You could make these savory by adding some cheese and some maybe garlic, some Italian seasonings for fantastic buns. You could make them sweet. You could add in some sweeteners of some kind with vanilla, maybe some cinnamon if you're okay with the oxalates. Totally up to you. But how cool is that? They actually look like Eggo waffles. They're so super yellow. So I'll rip into it for you a little bit and they have kind of that nice breaded texture. Mm. They're just very simple and plain, much like the Eggo waffles where they didn't have a ton of flavor by themselves. You always had to add the syrup or something else to them to make them. Mm. These are so easy. I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw my shoes on. I'm gonna go drive to my chiropractor appointment. But I wanted to share that with you guys because I didn't want to make it and then leave and not eat it and not record it. So literally I did this in, it's been like hmm, 11 minutes in 30 seconds. So I hope you guys enjoy these. I hope that this gives you an idea of what you can do with those leftover yolks so that you don't have any more leftover yolks unless you're, you know, like dipping your burger in it or something like that because that I wholeheartedly support doing because it's fantastic. So thanks so much guys uh, for checking in. Check down below for all the links, free Mighty Network, VIP Mighty Network, and everything else. So we'll see you guys on the way. Bye. Bella, be quiet, sweetie. Mm. So good. So good. Okay, gotta run. Bye.